Imagine being friends with somebody and it's revealed on live stream that they have been paying to watch deep fake P-R-R-N of you. Well, that's exactly what happened to this streamer. Stream to like create a pattern of behavior where I really want, especially women on Twitch to feel safer. Like I, uh, we call booba spam cringe. We don't do that there. I've never made like a fucking weird, I don't know, seat sniffing joke. I've never done anything like that. I've never done anything like that on this stream. And we don't tolerate any sex behavior in the chat. We, we ban it on site. And, uh, and like, I've done this consistently over and over and over. And then at 2 a.m., you know, I've been, I've been watching so much, fucking, I've been reading so much fucking AI stuff. I'm reading all this stuff about sure. AI and, and, uh, and fucking sure. defake music, defake art and everything. And I'm in these fucking discords and I was, I just feel so embarrassing to me. But I was on fucking, dude, I was on a fucking regular ass normal fucking website and there was an ad. There's an ad on every fucking video for this fucking... So I know other people must be clicking it because it's on every fucking video for a fucking deepfake thing. And then I... Really weird atmosphere, you know, him and his wife crying on stream about this, which I can understand her pain because, first of all, he was watching deepfake P of Pokimane and some other streamers that are their friends, especially like his wife's friends. First of all, I really don't believe him that he was watching P and that there were these ads that were popping up to watch Pokimane P. Like, I'm sorry, but that I find that really hard to believe that you switch from, you were looking up AI music, art, all this kind of stuff, and then you come across deep fake Pokimane corn. Like, make it makes sense. I really don't care what one wants to watch in their private time, as long as it's ethical, legal, fine, of course. I personally believe that deep fake pee should be illegal because you are using somebody without their consent in this. And that is so traumatizing and disgusting because sometimes you actually cannot tell if it's a deep fake or not. The problem is you are literally friends with this woman, are you not? You decided to, it's not necessarily invading Pokimane's privacy, of course, because this isn't a real video of her. It is a deep fake video, so okay, whatever. But you still went ahead and watched it because you don't think with your head, you think with your dick. And that's the problem. It's gross bro especially because it's like you know people say all the time men and women can be friends men and women can be friends but as soon as they're friends with a woman they think about her insanely sexually and then they go ahead and try and find any sort of sexual content about her and then it leads to this and he's only crying because he's being caught doing it. He's only crying because people know how creepy he is. And I'm sorry, I don't give a f especially if you are friends with somebody, report that. Report that shit ASAP. They're beating off to her or whatever is, that is not a friend. You are now a creep and you do not deserve to be friends with women. I'm sorry, but if that is how you are going to view your female friends, you. And that's not to say that people don't have fantasies about their friends, but he has a wife and that is basically his co-worker. He's a Twitch streamer. Pokimane is a fellow Twitch streamer. So like, what the f*** are you actually doing, bro? And I see people who are hating on his wife and shit, like saying, why the f*** is she just sitting there and crying? And why hasn't she gotten up and left? Like, it's really not that easy. She is probably obviously very visibly hurt by this because that's their friend. And he's trying to put the blame on these, you know, corn hub ads. But at the end of the day, it doesn't matter what kind of ads come up. Are you saying that even if there was something like CP to come up on a corn hub ad, you're gonna be like, oh, I just clicked on it because the ad was everywhere and I just wanted to see what it was. I honestly don't know what's more embarrassing. Paying to watch these videos of your, you know, friend and watching it on the computer that you stream on or paying literally $15 a month to see this kind of content. You are sick. Now, with that being said, that is all my thoughts and opinions for today. If you have any, leave them down in the comment section below because this situation is insane. My love goes out to his wife. 
I hope his wife finds somebody who doesn't do this shit to her. She's a baddie. She deserves better. And I hope, you know, Pokimane and any other women who have been affected by this are okay because it can be very, very traumatic knowing the fact that there is somebody that you have been friends with who has been creeping on you behind your back. Gross, disgusting. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys soon. Take care of yourselves and most of all, love your fucking selves.